Hi, I'm Janet Burton, and I'm going to play O oh to Joy for December's Song of the Month. I'm going to play slowly through my tab and try to show you what I've done. I do use some partial chords and I do have some skip notes and hammer-ons and so I'll try to explain those and I hope the tab also helps. I'll show you how I play. I'm in double D tuning. A, D, A, D, E. I'm starting with a D chord, just fretting on the first string, second fret, with a bum ditty. And then walk up the neck to the third fret, and then the fifth fret. Then you're going to walk down, but I like to do a partial chord by moving my second finger to the second string, fourth fret, so I get that sound. So I've got... a D chord without using the first string. Using your second fret there, and then a full D chord, and a pull off. Then an A7 chord, which is your index finger on the fourth string, second fret, and your second finger on the second string, second fret. And then I'm putting in the fifth string as if I was doing a bum titty but not doing the stroke. Then repeat. And the ending measure is a little different. And I'm pulling off on that A7 chord with my second finger. ghost note. So we've got this so far. The second half of the song is starting on that A7 chord I showed you bum ditty and then moving back to the D chord with the bum ditty again but this time I'm moving off of the A7 chord to a hammer on again A7 and then the hammer on which repeats So that four measures goes like this. Back to the beginning, and this next line is just like the whole second line.